Hello! This week I reflect on yesterday's virtual showcase event, another success, and also some thoughts on how the pandemic is ending. My name is Hamish Robertson and I'm the CEO and co-founder of the Watch Collectors Club and this is my weekly vlog about my journey into the crazy world of entrepreneurship. Last night we held another successful virtual showcase event over Zoom. It was on the theme of microbrand watches and due to it being summer, attendance was slightly smaller than uh, some of the previous events, but we still had a great time. I'm also delighted to report we had our first overseas attendee, a guy from New York. It's a really interesting uh, format, these events, because they're very, very simple. We're just collecting photos of watches we own and then talking about them to each other. We're also looking at some of the watches we would like to own if we could. It, it's amazing how successful that simplicity is. The time flies. People always say things that you didn't know or suggest watches you didn't know about to look up later. And also they uh, bring some passion behind the reasons they own and we hear the stories of why they own these watches and what they like about them. It's really promising that such a simple format will work and as we go through the rest of the year we hope to do more of these events, hopefully as many as two a month uh, before the end of the year and of course as the weather changes more people will be able to attend. We'll also be able to experiment with formats, topics, times, different ideas we have. I'm really looking forward to it and I think that the ones we've run so far have definitely shown that it is a format that will work. If you're interested, uh, find us at the, on the website or on Instagram and make sure you're uh, registered for our email so that you don't miss out. Another thing I wanted to talk about was the as the pandemic ends here in the UK, we're getting this so-called pingdemic as people are told to isolate to uh, prevent the further contagion. With most people now vaccinated, it's not that the risk is really to their health, it's just the risk of spreading it to someone whose health might still be at risk. As has happened so many other times during this pandemic, it's causing a lot of people to have to reflect on what they're sacrificing uh, to help others. As well as this self-reflection, which I think has been very valuable for many people, we've also seen a great increase as the pandemic has ebbed in people socialising again and getting together with friends and family. The enthusiasm, commitment and effort people are putting into this to rekindle friendships that have been separated by uh, all the lockdowns and such like, and catch up with people, find out what people are into, and make sure that those friendships strengthen again in future is really promising to me. We're seeing communities come together, even if it's a community of friends, it's showing that the desire to build communities is possibly even stronger after the pandemic than it was before. This is great for me looking to build a business uh, around a community of watch collectors, and where we hope to bring people together so they can share their love of watches, learn more, and indeed, hopefully make some friends. I think that the trends should continue. I'm very excited to continue running events and build uh, the types of event we can run, including returning to in-person events when possible. And I'm really looking forward to the next few months as the pandemic uh, fades away and the restrictions end further. Thank you very much for watching. If you're interested in the Watch Collectors Club, please go to www.thewatchcollectors.club or follow us on Instagram. Thank you.